Oh, hey, everybody. Welcome to this Wix Partner Community Roundtable. Today, we're going to be talking all about what's new for the Wix app. I'm your host, Brett, and I'm so glad that you're here. And look at this amazing, beautiful team we have here. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Hi, Brett. Hey, Brett. So we brought the whole team. And, and, and look at this. We've got content, product marketing, head of growth, master of design. Aron Levy is here with us. Super excited about that. And also joining us for the partner community is JD. Welcome, JD. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. So we have a stacked deck here. This is going to be interesting. So uh, we're glad you're here. But first off, Abby, can you tell us what we're going to be learning today? What's in store? Absolutely. Well, Brett, there's lots we want to cover today and some really exciting announcements coming up. First, we're going to talk a little bit about the Wix mobile app journey so far, the product that we offer today, and it's incredible at success. We'll then introduce a very special guest, Wix partner JD, uh, who will talk a little bit about uh, the app and how it's really had a huge impact on his business, how he uses it day to day. Then we'll move on to reveal some exciting changes to the app that are coming very, very soon. Uh, we'll even show you some screenshots that you can read so you can really get a sense of what it looks like. We'll then introduce our beta program that we'd love all of you guys to join so we can get your valuable feedback about the new app followed by a rough timeline for these changes that are happening in the coming weeks. And finally, we'd like to open the floor to you guys to give you a chance to ask any questions you might have at the end. Uh, now, for now, I think uh, I'll hand over to Elad, uh, who will kick it all off. So, so Elad, let's, let's talk a little bit about, and thank you, Abby, for that. And by the way, there is a Q&A. If you have questions, go ahead and drop them. We're going to try to circle back and get to them. Elad, can you tell us, the Wix app has really evolved over the years. Can you tell us a little bit about that and, and, and what, what it is today? You're muted, sir. Sorry. So while our mission has always been uh, to allow our uh, customers and professionals to uh, create, manage, and grow their business from the app, I think we started the journey around four years ago uh, while we introduced few uh, management capabilities. Specifically, it was chat and store uh, orders management, but as time went by, we added more and more functionality uh, to the app. And today, the Wix app is actually a capsulation of everything or almost everything that Wix has to offer into a single app. Moreover, around two years ago, we introduced uh, the app member view. Uh, it allowed our customers and our professionals to invite their customers to a mobile native uh, space in which they can engage in a feature-rich uh, mobile native environment. Um, it was, in our eyes, a huge success because today many millions of customers of customers are getting to enjoy this experience. So I would agree, and I... I... I use the app with within the partner community specifically and, and other spaces that I'm in. J but 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 let's jump to JD. Now, JD, you use this, you use this app and now you're in a very different way, right? So one, you 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 own a digital agency and you use it for your 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 clients, but you also as an author use it in some of your your those sites and where you sell books or or engage with some of your your audience. Tell us kind of your day-to-day -day with this app and, and what you use with it or how you use it. Sure, sure. Well, first, thank you, everybody, for having me here. It's uh, this is really, really cool. And, um, well, the app has really helped us at the agency to keep track of uh, certain behaviors that we want people to take when it comes to our clients' websites. And features on the app like the chat, you know, the uh, the marketing campaigns and seeing the active leads and what they're doing has helped us come up with concise strategies for them, whether it's social, whether it's actions we want them to take in the future. And obviously that also trickled down to my career as an author because I want the reader to have this immersive experience. And those features allow me to do just that. If a message comes in, there's that ability to immediately reply and to see what they're doing. And uh, it, it, it almost makes, it makes it more of a human interaction. So it's, it's helped us out a lot. So thank you for that. The, the question is, I guess, where is it going to go, right? So we've, we've had a little bit of what it is. We've had some, some case study or a use, use study here from, by JD, and thank you. So where is it going to go? Sure. So while we added more and more functionality to the app, 
uh, we realized that in order to get the best user experience, we must streamline the owner experience and the member experience in two separate apps. So we came up with what you can refer as dual app solution. Uh, we know that owners are coming to the app mainly to manage their business or manage their website or manage their mobile space. Um, while members are coming to engage with their customer. Um, so moving on, we will introduce uh, the Wix owner app and we will rename the existing app to Spaces by Wix. Um, today we will focus primarily on the Wix owner app, but just to, 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 to have a few more words about the separation, in the owner app, you can expect to do stuff like uh, accessing the dashboard, just as you can access to the dashboard from the, from the website, from Wix website, you can access to the dashboard from the app. You can see the stats of your business. You can manage your inbox. You can manage your orders and so much more. Um, and from the spaces by Wix for your members, you can see how your members will see the app. Uh, you can engage with them, uh, with your members. Uh, where they can uh, shop uh, products, uh, book services, RSVP to events, engage in groups, and and much much more. So so it seems that there's a, a clear separation here between managing the business and engaging. Correct. So that's that's really cool. I mean, I know you were, we we we're going to show a little more about that, but just for uh, I'm just curious, JD, does this sound like something? I know you haven't seen it yet. We're about to see it. Does this sound like something pretty interesting? Absolutely, especially when it comes to building community around brands, and I think that's that's such, such an important goal right now. So I I, I'm, I love it. So let's jump in. Um, I know we have a, a, de a demo planned, or or at least that. Yes, there we go. So please show us what we're show us what this looks like. Thanks, Beth. Uh, so as you get it by now, we're building an app dedicated for owners. But as we're doing it, we want to offer a smarter way to manage their business and a faster navigation. So um, the app, the app home screen gives you uh, an uh, easy review of your business on the go and offer you a quick way to perform additional action. Let's say, for example, you're an array and you don't have your laptop on you and you want to check like a product status. You just open the app, scroll down to the relevant feature you're looking for. And by the way, you can uh, reorder the widget. So next time it will be uh, at first and you don't need to scroll down. And if you want to do more uh, advanced actions, it's also faster on the app. Uh, so we added uh, shortcuts on the top of the dashboard so you can easily access to your most used features and screens. In addition, we added on the bottom uh, a quick action menu so you can easily perform your most common actions. And we added a new screen. Yeah, we added a new screen where you can uh, easily view an outline of your website and app and quickly share, edit, and view them. And you can also chat on the app like usual, and we moved the site switcher so you can switch between sites to the top where you can see the business name. And that's about that. Hope you Aran, Aran, this is this is really interesting, and it's going to be a little bit a little bit new for the partners. JD, I'd love to get your take, just sort of looking at this, sort of what's your first gut reaction here, kind of to see what's under the hood here. <laughs> Clients will be very happy, especially especially with this the e-commerce section of it, just because everything's so mobile right now. And we work with a lot of clients that use the e-commerce platform inside Wix. And this is just going to benefit us as an agency so much and them. Absolutely. This is going to be incredible. I think so too. Um, and I know we have a Q and a session coming up, but before we get to so if you do have any questions, this is, uh, please drop them now so I can come back to them in a, in a little bit. Let's talk. I, I mean, I guess the question that I want to ask is when is this available? How do we get involved? Okay, Brett. Yes. Thank you. So, uh, Exciting, uh, the closed beta is open and uh, your, your feedback as professionals are really, really important to us. Uh, just to, we can uh, fit the future, uh, we can create a better app in the future to fit all your needs and all your customers' needs. So please uh, join, join our closed beta. You can join on iOS via the test flight app or on the Google Play uh, with the early access. 
And uh, Brett will share the links right after this session so everyone can uh, can uh, download the, the beta and to start exploring uh, this beautiful app. And for the rollout plan, yeah, want to say no, something? Well, well, I was going to say just just to be just to be clear, I'll I'll edit the description of this video and make sure it's added so so, so for those who are watching to, so they know where to go. Cool. So for the rollout plan, so as I was mentioning, the, we are now in the in the closed beta phase, and uh, once we will finish the beta, we will roll out the Wix owner app for three uh, important markets: the UK, Canada, and Australia. And it's very important to keep in mind that once the, the Wix owner app will be submitted to these markets, we will rename the current app to be the Spaces by Wix, as Elad mentioned earlier. Um, so you will you will see both apps uh, on the app stores, and moving forward, uh, we will uh, we will uh, deploy the app to all other countries uh, in the near future. This is great. So we have Q and A now, and I have a couple questions. But if there's something that that in general you want to ask the team, we have the entire panel here. So please ask your questions now. And here's one, I, there, there's a couple here, and, 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 I'll, and I'll sort of, I'll sort of uh, there's, there's several here. And I think the question really is, and I'll, I'll direct this directly, I guess, to you, Alad. A lot of partners are, are curious to know about, is it possible to add custom branding, uh, white label? Is, is that possible or is it in the works? It's certainly a feature request from, the, from our partners. Yeah. Yeah, so we've been getting that a lot, and and we acknowledge that it is interesting primarily for uh, top tier customers that professionals uh, like the partner uh, team are often working with, um, and we understand the need. Um, while you know we usually, as a public company, we're not disclosing future plans, uh, we are definitely you know uh, staying very. Um, attentive to our customer needs and and you know you can you can assume that what we introduced today is just another milestone in our mobile journey uh, there are other news uh, uh, to come from the Wix mobile team in the future so stay tuned there I like that answer it's a little vague but I'm feeling mm. the vibe I like it okay real quick question it, it, the rollout plan didn't in, in include India is India on the rollout plan in the future? Uh oh, Abby, you're muted. Sorry, I'll answer that. So uh, in terms of, of other languages that we'll offer the app to, certainly, um, you know, we're always moving forward and looking to expand our range of uh, geos and locales. Um, and it's something that we'll, we'll definitely keep uh, everyone up to date about um, in the hopefully sort of in the, in the near future. These are great questions. And I, I think it's kind of it's going to take a little bit of uh, uh, practice for the partners to get in. So I guess my question is, when can the partners participate in this beta? So they can participate uh, from today. Once we today. share the links, yes, they can download it. Already participate in the beta. So I, I, and and one more one more, I'll take one more quick question. Um, sort of. What other, uh, Robert wants to know, is there, like, are you planning additional functionality? And I think you alluded to that just a moment ago, Alad. Additional functionality to the owner and including other spaces that Wix is in, for example, restaurants or such. Yeah, so um, we are keep um, adding more and more functionality to the app. Uh, sometimes the app is uh, introduced first in the web. Sometimes the functionality is introduced first um, on, on mobile, but eventually we're uh, aiming at parity between our mobile experience and the web experience. If to uh, answer specifically about restaurants, then yes, um, we definitely uh, um, working hard to mitigate any gaps in that area as well. Great, great answer. Thank you for that. And great question, Robert. I'll, I'll grab one more than I know y'all are busy building some amazing stuff. So Here's one that I think is interesting, and if not, it's a great feature request. Can you 
access the partner dashboard via the new app. But I do know you can access the partner community from the app because it's definitely there. But what about the partner dashboard? So today, um, you cannot access the partner dashboard uh, through the app. Um, um, it's something that uh, that we are, you know, uh, looking into, and we are actually it's it's on it's on our table to better understand how the app can cater specifically uh, for partners' requirements, and um, and uh, we will be happy, you know, to uh, to hop uh, onto a, a, a discovery call. Uh, if if uh, it was Chris, right? The 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 name of the I believe uh, so. It yeah. was yeah, Chris. Yeah. So Chris uh, will be happy to hop into a call and to learn more about your expectation as a partner from the app, um, and uh, you know, and and to get it done. Interesting. That would be such a great feature request. I, I that's I'm, I pulled that because Chris, that's such a great idea. I think the partners would love that. Okay, more stuff for y'all to do. You came here to show us something and now you've got a whole bunch of more stuff to go build. <laughs> so I wanna thank all of you for being here. This was really awesome. This is exciting. The beta starts today. I'll edit the link, get in there and let's give you guys some feedback, tell you what we like, what we, what, some more of our feature requests like partner dashboard. So I wanna say thanks to everybody for coming. This has been really awesome. So. Thanks, everybody. This was great. Y'all have a great day. Thanks again. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Bye, Thank you. Bye, Bye everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.